Bible on planet Earth. The rapture is coming. Listen, are you listening? Are you listening to the hoofbeats of the approaching four horsemen of the apocalypse? The seven last plagues are coming. The name, the number, the image, the mark of the beast is coming. Apocalypse, Armageddon, Antichrist, and are approaching Jesus Christ. It is the last days of the end times. Are you listening to me? He was flawless. He was perfect. The Lamb of God. And that's why he could die on the cross. And that's why he gave us his word. And that's why the Bible is the inspired, infallible, inerrant word of God. The perfect, pure word of Almighty God. Profitable for all doctrine, correction, instruction, reproof. Hallelujah. The word of Almighty God. It is a flawless gospel. And number four, it is a forgiving gospel. On this point, all you got to do is look at Mike Dot. I don't have to tell you my testimony. I don't have to dig up what I did in the past. I don't have to dig up and glorify sin. All I got to do is tell you, I'm not that man that I was. I am a new man. I am a new creature. I am the righteousness of God. God said, why do you remember your past? Because I forgot it. Hallelujah. It's a forgiving gospel. Though your sins be red like crimson, though they be scarlet, they shall be white as wool. And God can separate your sin as far as the east is from the west. It is a forgiving gospel. I don't care if you're living together outside of marriage and fornicating and having premarital sex. I don't care if you've been divorced. I don't care if you're having an adulterous affair or cussing or lying or cheating or stealing or whatever you're doing. Jesus will forgive you right now. All you have to do is fall on your knees and say, God, I'm a sinner. God, I repent. God, I turn to Jesus. Jesus, save me. Jesus, come into my heart. I make you Lord. Wash me. Fill me with the Holy Spirit in Jesus' name. And the Bible says you can be born again. Born again. There's really been a change in me. Born again just like Jesus. Hallelujah. It is a forgiving gospel. It is a grace gospel. More grace. More grace. More grace. Because that's what we need. But grace, listen, is not just God's power to forgive sin. It's God's almighty power.